On New Zealand MPs think it's time for a serious debate about what is the right age for children to have social media accounts. It comes amid a push in Australia to lift the age from 13 to 16 years old. Here is Grace Thomas with more. There's a few big firsts in a young person's life. Learning how to drive at 16 years old, legally buying alcohol at 18. Compared to that, being able to sign up to Facebook, Instagram and TikTok at 13 seems relatively harmless, but experts disagree. Research has consistently shown that it re results in anxiety, depression, self-harm, and it is a public health problem, and we need to start you know, acting like it is one. That's why there's growing momentum in Australia to increase the legal age to have a social media account from 13 to 16. An Australian radio host has started a petition calling for change. It's already got more than 100,000 signatures and has been backed by Prime Minister Anthony Albanese. If we can at least have the parents and give the parents the power to say, you know what, guys, stealing a car's illegal, robbing a bank's illegal and being on social media, you know what? That's illegal too prior to the age of 16. Australia is not the only country to start having the conversation about banning under 16s from social media. France, the UK and the US have all considered it too. Back here, ACT and Labor are relatively open to the idea. Just given what we know, the research that we have um, on brain development in young people. I'm open to that debate. But the Minister of Technology, Nationals Judith Collins, believes restrictions should be down to the parents. I think you try and put something like that in place, you're going to end up with a whole lot of kids even younger straight in there. I just think let parents get on with their job. Researcher Samantha Marsh says if an age ban was enacted, it's not as simple as just going cold turkey. They are so dependent on it. We will have to help our children adjust back to a, a phone-free childhood. And the biggest challenge might still be keeping kids off it, even if the rules were changed. Grace Thomas, News Hub.